Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. I'm going to show you how to change the editing permissions on Microsoft SharePoint. And this is perfect if you don't want everyone to have access to edit everything on your Microsoft SharePoint site. So without further ado, let's come straight in. So we're going to start out here in team. So we're going to go into the page that we're looking for. So we're in general and files and you'll see all of the files here for that page. And we're going to go over to the right hand side and you're going to look for the three dots over here. Now, here you will find a shortcut called open in SharePoint. Now, if you you can't find it there, you will actually still be able to find it here in your SharePoint. So if you go into my sites, you will actually see it just over here. So there it is. It's that general in essence. And this is what it looks like. So what we're going to do from here is go to pages on the left. And from here, we are going to select that page that we want to change those permissions for. So let's go ahead and we are going to click on the three dots and we're going to look for manage access. Now, the manage access will give you a few different things over here, people, groups and links. So if you're going into groups, you'll see these are the people that have permissions and you can see that one of the members over here says can edit now if you click on this you can change it here but that's not what we want to do because this is going to be temporary what we want to do is on the top you're going to see the three dots you're going to look for advanced settings and this is going to take you to your sharepoint settings all right this is your site settings so you'll go into permissions you can again access this if you're going into the gear icon on the right hand side and you are going to look for site permissions this is where you'll end up and you'll see this is where we are working this in essence members this one right over here and it says permission levels edit we're going to go and click on the top left stop inheriting permissions we're going to say okay and now we'll be able to select that here we can say remove user permissions or edit user permissions if you're editing you're going to go in here and you can change what it says here so right now it's currently on edit what you want to click on is read this means that members can only view pages and list items as well as download documents so you can you can choose what permissions you want to give the members and you're going to click on ok over here and uh, just always remember to make sure that somebody has full control so that there's still access to these settings and you're all done